prior to this, the Native Hawaiians haven't formally been recognized by the state of Hawaii as the Native peoples of Hawaii. Duh. I mean, come on. Here we are. This is Hawaii. We're the Hawaiians. However, there hasn't been any formal recognition. So now we've passed it out. We're waiting for the governor to sign it. He'll be signing it soon enough. And uh, uh, that means that the state will now recognize the Hawaiian people as the Maoli or the indigenous people of Hawaii. What does that do? Or do rather? It's largely symbolic in the sense that it's here now to support the Akaka bill. The Akaka office, the Office of Indian Affairs, advised us that it'd be best to kind of ramp it up a couple notches. So what we're going to do is we're going to uh, begin a roll call. Governor will be assigning five people to a commission, a roll call commission, from the five, four counties, Hawaii, Maui County, Kauai, Oahu, and an at-large. The commission will put together the roll call based on a definition of what is Native Hawaiian. For instance, Native Hawaiians will say are people who can trace their lineal background pre-overthrow, as an example, okay? Then that particular role, once it's done, uh, will be uh, used as the, the calling or the kahia for people to come together. So the short story is roll call, well, recognition, roll call, hopefully federal recognition. Meanwhile, roll call, membership, convention, organic document voted on by the people, the Native Hawaiians on the, on the roll and then eventual entity to be recognized by the federal government, already recognized by the state, and then everybody goes home happy. Justice is good for all, right? When it comes to non-Hawaiians, we just ask everyone, we understand that you're a big part of Hawaii. Most of all of us have something else. I mean, I'm Hawaiian, Filipino, Portuguese, okay? My kids are... Hawaiian, Filipino, Portuguese, Chinese. My grandkids are Hawaiian, Filipino, Black, Scotch, Irish, and all of the rest that I mentioned, right? So we're all mixed up right now. But still, going back to the host culture, we need to recognize the host culture as the people indigenous of this land. Nobody needs to feel threatened. Okay? It won't affect anyone's lifestyle. In fact, it'll bring more clarity to the situation so that with regard to the Native Hawaiians, we're no longer strangers in our own land, right? And the non-Hawaiians can be clear that they're also a part of Hawaii going forward. So to the non-Hawaiians, not to worry. We just need to clear up some past business.